Here we are at Bergie's welding machine craft. I had just bought a lathe. It's a mini one. Pick it up. I'm gonna do time warp of it. Hey. So here it is. It's a Paltra Manchester. And it's pretty good condition except for the paint's chipping off. And the shaft is bent. I think this one might be too a little bit. Yeah. And then we have all the different bits. They go in the head. So we're gonna take off the belt here because as you can see it's like ripping apart. Pop it right off like this. Spin, rotate this. So we spin that, and then this. Then we're gonna shove the belt through like that. Just in front of it. There we go. So now we have our belt out. We're gonna get a new belt and. Now we can start. dents in it in the bottom frame but it looks a lot better and one thing I do like is that you can just push that little lever down pull this off and then that's off and this one can take off but you need a small enough piece of metal to get in there to pry it so Yeah, and I forgot to tell you, I bought this from my great uncle. His name is Albert, great uncle Albert, for 75 bucks. But, I think it's a pretty fair price. So yeah, we might end up taking off the paint, but probably not today, because there's a little pile of chips paint. Super cool. I did see a couple pictures of them online where people had sandblasted them. So they just took the sandblaster and blasted all the paint off. Which seems kind of, oh look, did you see there's a little drain plug down there? Right oh, here in the middle? Plug. I'm guessing that's for like oil or something, if you wanted to like drain oil out. And then, as you saw, I'm using this hoop of steel as my dustpan. And this for my broom thing. My dad put to. And this was like on it, but it's like an aftermarket like design kind of thing. They like got it. Um, so the belt was ran from here, this slot, in there, right there. But the belt is actually supposed to come down through there. And then there's supposed to be a different motor, I'm assuming, because. My great grandpa, 
great great grandpa will be shot. So that's what I'm named after. Said that he died, but still have a great great grandma. So yeah, I got a lot of throw presses, drawing machines over there. So, he's in the vacuum, maybe. So, that is about all. I'll probably. Again, thanks to Albert for letting me buy this thing for 75 bucks.